we service of Pakistan. What is the motivation for that? Motivation what motivates you? Yes. Sir, as a girl growing up in at the state of in Pakistan, um, the issue of security always concerns us and our parents, and for uh, women, especially, especially uh, cumbersome because um, because of the issue of uh, security, we are. Uh, we lag behind or we are not allowed to avail many opportunities in our life that we can. Um, I believe, sir, um, that as a member of the police services, I can provide that security in any district that I am, in any area that I am, to the inhabitants so that they can pursue other um, aspects of their life freely. What are the basic responsibilities of police in a district? So the basic one is law and order. Um, and a lot of uh, aspects come under that um, uh, under under this ambit. Um, what are those? Uh, yes, sir. So um, fighting crime uh, in all forms. Um, whenever there is any any rally or anything uh, to take care of that. And um, yes, sir. What made Putin attack Ukraine? So there were many, uh, many fold reasons for his attack on Ukraine. First of all, sir, um, Russia, uh, the USSR uh, has always been very of the has always been um, apprehensive of its western side, sir, because all uh, the Russian empires have been attacked from the west side, sir, because it's plain land, and uh, they also they always uh, aspire to create a buffer uh, state or a buffer situation on the west side so that they can ensure their security. Um, sir, Ukraine was one of the former Soviet states, uh, along with the other ones such as Georgia. Um, uh, so, uh, NATO, uh, Ukraine was uh, was not was not a part of NATO, but it was an important NATO ally, non-NATO ally of the U.S. And at such, sir, it uh, received um, support uh, from the West, sir. And um, Russia feared that it might pose a security concern to its borders because Ukraine and Russia share a borders. Give your career a boost with CSSPMS preparation from Civil Services Preparatory School. Join CSSPMS for on-campus and online classes. Join us for your bright future. Civil Services Preparatory School, Jitan Markaz, Islamabad. Register now at 0316-570-1593. Are you familiar with the amendments made in the NAB ordinance? A number of amendments were made. Uh, I do know that amendments were made, but I am sorry, I do not know the specifications. How many amendments have so far been made in the constitution of Pakistan? Uh, sir, 26. What was the last one? Sir, 26 amendments, sir. It increased the seats of Fata in the National Assembly and the Provincial Assembly. And what is the 18th amendment about? Yes, sir. So, uh, 18 Amendment uh, was passed in uh, 2010, and sir, so it aimed at giving maximum provincial autonomy to the four provinces. Um, uh, under that, sir, uh, some cosmetic measures were taken, such as changing the names of the province of NWFP and changing the spellings of Sindh and Balochistan. And uh, the concurrent list, sir, uh, which had 47 subjects, uh, was devolved to provinces. 36 were devolved, and 10 were placed in the federal uh, list B. Um, uh, uh, which involved many provinces, uh, ministries such as electricity, health, education, curriculum to uh, provinces. And uh, uh, sorry, sir, to cut you, uh, uh, Article uh, 58, um, uh, uh, powers of the president were also contained uh, greatly in the 18th Amendment, sir. Um, what about Article 6? How was that? Yes, sir. Artic yes, sir. Article 6A was amended and Article 6A was added under which. Uh, um, not only uh, uh, abrogation but uh, suspension also was made uh, um, subject to high treason and uh, taking part and uh, abating uh, taking part in uh, suspending the constitution was also made uh, a high treason. And there was something else to it also. Please go and have a look at it. Yes. Okay. Uh, you are perfectionist. You say that is your weakness. Yes. Why? So it can be unnecessary and it can be very time taking uh, because uh, not everything uh, can be done or achieved perfectly and we have to uh, look for the best possible way often. So what's wrong about it? If you are a, if you want to be perfect, what's so bad about it? 
Um, Do you differentiate between perfect, being perfect and and being a perfectionist? Are, are these two different things from your point of view? Uh, so being tr always trying to achieve perfection in all spheres of life uh, leads to a lot of self-doubt and a lot of self-anxiety about ourselves and our, about our own actions because we're always overthinking and over overdoing stuff. Okay.